Oh yes, very good. So here we are. There's a, a there, yeah, there's a fucking conversation. Look at the radar. It's the it's radar. Up the DARPA chief. He's the green dot. Hurry and rescue him. Oh god, Re fucking relegated to be a green dot. There he is. Let's see. Can we call his attention? Oi, sir. Like, open up. Open up, white boy. He's actually not white at all, but... Level 6. Better come prepared, boy! And knock that door down, never mind. Uh, there seems to be somebody... Over here. Gee, I wonder who that is. Uh... No, it's a ration, and I cannot... It's full. It's a full ration. Hello, who is this? Snake, if you wanna go up or down a ladder... Just press the action button by the ladder. <sighs> yes. I know about the fucking action button. Now, I guess I could go out of my way and try to show you guys a little bit of a, a goof here. Let's see. First of all, this is not a goof. This is a thing. Ugh, kind of damn cold. I hate Alaska. Uh-oh. Boy, oh boy, that woman is built all right. Here goes. <laughs> Rape attempt. Always keeping it light, boys. Just remember to keep keep your game light and free of rape, because otherwise other people will accuse you of being misogynistic. Uh, that's the thing that happens, apparently. Uh, people can indeed be misogynistic. I'm not. I'm a nice guy. I swear. My lady. Uh no no, I used to be like that. Not that not like that, but you know, like in in practice, I've noticed with the past of time that I was fucking a cringy sixteen year old boy. Let's see. Is that a woman? That's a woman, not him. Not him. Not this one. And she is built all right, apparently. Let me just show you why she is built all right. Now, if you will, if you will, uh. Humor me for this. Uh, it, it might take a little bit, a little bit of time, but I swear it pays off. Well, I mean, it pays off for me. I don't know why you people, you people. All right, let's see. Let's go down the ladder again, right? Yes. Let's go back up the ladder now. Oh yes. And this time we're gonna go all the way down again. And we're gonna look down the window and look at that woman that's built all right. Who could it be? Maybe it's the Colonel's niece, Meryl Sir Silverboro. Silverboro, sis. Meryl Silverboro. Silverboro, sis. Meryl. Let's see. What the hell is she doing? Oh, wow. God damn. Give it up for Meryl. Fuck sakes. For fuck's sake. She sure trains hard. Now let's see what else she can come up with once we go out the... Um, the water cooler, I was gonna say. The ventilation shafts. I... I'm sorry about my spastic head moves. It's just that the Xbox controller isn't the best for the D-pad. And my... Uh, Joystick is fucked up, so I don't really want to use that to move with Snake. Like, I prefer to be spastic than to be uncontrollably moving to the right. Which you might have noticed if you see Persona. Saki does that, he keeps fucking walking to the right. And when I'm not, like, if I don't touch anything, he just... Which is fucked up, but... What are we gonna do, huh? <laughs> Let's see. What is she doing now? Damn! Is that... She is flexible too. She does have like a knife um, sheath, it seems to be. Pretty impressive. I don't know why they would let her keep the sheath. You could argue that, like, what's he gonna do with the sheath? Like, stab somebody? with like a piece of, of leather, but, you know, it's a bit debatable. Like, why even keep the sheath? Why not just remove it while you're in there? 
But what do I know? I'm not in Fox Allen. I don't need nails for seconds. I used to be in Fox Allen. Remember that time when I was in Fox Allen and we uh, entered Sansibar Land and Outer Heaven? Those were some fun times. But I'm retired from Fox Allen now. And I also have like a drippy nose. Virgil the Drippy Dragon. This Let's Play is sponsored by Bad Dragon. Go buy your dildo, bitch. Let's see. Ooh! Oh, yeah, would you look at that? That's some hot pixelated moves. Hello. Snake, the DARPA chief signal is coming from somewhere in that area. Isn't there some place to drop down? Yes. Take a look around in first person view mode. What do you think I've been doing all this time? Let's have a looky. And just when before you can do anything, the cutscene triggers. And remember the ventilation shafts were being touched to like you know spray for rats. Hello. I'm here to save you. You're the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, right? You here to save me, huh? Yep. What's your outfit? I'm the pawn they sent here to save your worthless butt. Fucking love Snake Man. Really? Yes. It's true. You don't look like one of them. In that case, hurry up and get me out of here. Slow down. Don't worry. First, I want some information about the terrorists. The terrorists? Do they really have the ability to launch a nuke? What are you talking about? The terrorists are threatening the White House. They say if they don't accede to their demands, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. Sweet Jesus. Is it possible? It's possible. When? They could launch a nuke. Uh, what? How do they what? Not launch? I thought this place was just for keeping the dismantled warheads. They shouldn't I have access that. to a missile. What I'm about to tell you is classified information. Okay. Okay. We're conducting exercises with a new type of experimental weapon. A weapon that will change the world. What? A weapon with the ability to launch a nuclear attack from any place on the face of the Earth. A nuclear-equipped walking battle tank. You don't mean... Surely not. Metal Gear... It can't be... You knew? Yes. Metal Gear is one of the most secret black projects. I fought two already. How did you know that? We've I had fought a two already. Yeah. In the past. So that's yeah, yeah, the reason yeah. you were here at this disposal site? Why else would I come to a godforsaken place like this? Yeah, Alaska's nice. I had heard the Metal Gear project was scrapped. On the contrary. It's grown into a huge joint project between arms tech and ourselves. We were going to use this exercise as raw data and then proceed to mass production. Boo. If it hadn't been for the revolution. Revolution? Rex has fallen into the hands of terrorists. What terrorists? Just a second ago you were saying that. Yes, Rex. Metal Gear Rex. The code name for the new Metal Gear prototype. They've probably already finished arming the warhead they plan to use with Rex. These guys are pros. They're all experienced in handling and equipping weapons. Hey! Shut up in there, will ya? No. He actually fucking listens to him. Impressive. But I thought that all nuclear warheads were equipped with safety measures. Some kind of detonation code that you have to input. Oh, you mean PAL? Yes, of course. Yeah, there Pally. Is PAL. It's set up so that you need to input two different passwords in order to launch the device. There are two passwords? Yes. Baker knows one, and I know one. Baker? The president of arms tech. That's right. Each of us needs to input our password, or there can be no launch. But they found out my password. 
You talked. Yeah, I mean... Psychomantis can read people's minds. You can't resist. Psychomantis? Psychomantis, yes. One of the members of Foxhound. He has psychic powers. He's a psychomantis. This is bad. It's just a matter of time before they get Baker's too. If they find out Baker's password... Yes, they'll be able to launch a nuke any time. But there is a way to stop the launch. What? The card keys. Card keys? They were designed by Armstead, the system developers, as an emergency override. Even without the passwords, you can just insert the card keys and engage the safety lock. Okay. And if I do that? Yes. You can stop the launch. Okay, that's good. That card key. So where are the keys? Baker should have them. Listen, you need three card keys. There are three different slots to put them in. You need to insert a card into each one of them. Okay, three card keys. Do you know where they might be keeping Baker? Somewhere in the second floor basement. Second floor basement? I heard the guards say they moved him to an area that has a lot of electronic jamming. What? No radar from the other baby. Clues? Yes, they cemented over the entrances, but didn't have enough time to paint them. Why don't you look for the areas where the walls are a different color? I'll keep an eye out. Here, take this. It's my ID card. It'll open any level one security door. Here we go it's again. A pad card. For all I remember this, we will give it to an electrical field. Personal area network, huh? It transmits data using the salts in your body as the transmission lead. Fuck off. Okay, that doesn't and work. you the door security devices. They'll read the data stored in the card. And the doors will open automatically. Gotcha. It just doesn't work like that. Okay, I'm gonna get you out of here. Wait a minute. What is it? You haven't heard any other way to disarm the pal, have you? From your bosses or anyone? No. Are you sure you haven't heard anything? I just said no. So does the White House plan to give in to the terrorist demands? That's their problem. It has nothing to do with my orders. But what about the Pentagon? The Pentagon? Ooh, what is it? Why you? Hey, what happened? That's what I'd like to know. <laughs> and he's dead. Kids, I sure you were I'm sure you weren't expecting that one. Dead. I wasn't expecting that one, that's for sure. Naomi, the chief. What happened? I I don't know. It looked like a heart attack, but... A heart attack? No. Colonel, are you hiding something from me? Absolutely not. Snake, you've got to understand. This op is security level red. You need the highest security clearance to get access to the complete file. You want me to believe that you're in charge of this op, but you don't have complete access to the file? I told you. The Secretary of Defense is in operational control. Okay. I'm just here as your support. Snake. We don't have time to debate. Get out of there and find President Baker. I guess I have no other choice but to uh, deal with this. Uh, what's going on over there? Hello? Hi? Lady? She's out of the cell. I mean, that's cool too. Let's see what happened to that other guy. Seems, I think he's over there, but we can't really look very far away. Let's see. Can I look like this? I can indeed look like, oh, 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 oh man. <laughs> that's an unfortunate scenario. And Don't move. FAMAS 
So you killed the chief. I did. You bastard. Apparently. Liquid? No, you're not. Don't no. move. Is this the first time you ever pointed a gun at a person? Your hands are shaking. <laughs> Oof. Can you shoot me, rookie? Careful. I'm no rookie. Really? Liar. That nervous glance. That scared look in your eyes. They're rookies' eyes if I ever saw them. You've never shot a person, am I right? You talk too much. You haven't even taken the safety off, rookie. <laughs> I told you I'm no rookie. Meanwhile, the fucking you? SWAT is here. They're gonna get swatted. Open that door. You've got a card, don't you? Why? So listening. we can get the hell out of here. Looks like we'll be a little delayed. Delayed, but I mean the door is open. What are you doing? Don't think. Shoot. Yeah, shoot, shoot him. Like this. There you go. This is how you shoot him. Oh, I mean, there you go. This is how you shoot him. What are you waiting for? Shoot! Don't talk to me like a rookie. Just move them, fucking shoot him. Like I'm this. You. Shoot! There you go. See, they can't fucking shoot for shit themselves. So we might as well shoot him to death. Shoot him a bunch. There we go. Oh yes. This is how I do it. The sick of the rations. Hey, I did it again. Um, surely nothing bad's gonna happen, but but I don't want to have a nasty surprise at all. Too many fucking weapons. Too many bullets. I mean, and oh shit. No, thank you. Hey, oh, look. I could actually just fucking slap him. That does work, but. I don't feel like doing that. There we go. We're clear. Wiggle, wiggle. Thanks for that help. No problem. Wait. Who are you? You fool! You've killed him. I'm sorry, sir. His mental shielding was very strong. I could not dive into his mind. Now we'll never get that detonation code. Boss, I have a good idea. The hell was that all about? It's really hard to act as if I don't know what's going on, but I'm I'm doing it for your sake. For the ones that don't actually know what's going on. Damn. You're free to try and figure out what's what's happening on the comments or letting me know directly because you probably know you probably have no steam. <sniffs> Looking at you. Good girl. Just like that. Yes, hello? I just had some kind of hallucination. Is it from the nanomachines? No, Snake. The nanomachines are functioning properly. So what was it? It must have been psychometric interference coming from Psychomantis, Foxhound Psychic. Oh. Think of it as a mental feedback loop. So that was Mantis. Yeah, that was Mantis. Yep. Okay, so now we have keycard one. Keycard number one, which allows you to open many doors like this. Pretty sure. I don't know if there was something down here. This a ration, but I mean, we we're full on rations, so we don't really need it. This guy, this poor lad, is having a sleep. Not sure if there was something down here. No, there wasn't. It's been a while since I played this game, so give me a break, okay? I'm sorry, okay? Let's see, what else? Succumbulet. Succumbulet. More succumbulet, and we're back. Full fucking strength. Now this is a level six store, so we can forget about that one. However, we will try and go back up, all the way up, because I'm pretty sure there are some things that we can grab at the tippy top. Now I did say I would never get caught again, but that was a scripted event. So stop giving me shit. I will get caught again. I will get caught again. Fuck me. No, never mind. I will not get caught again. You can actually make people freeze. 
you can freeze them to death. No, you can you can tell them freeze, and they freeze it's on the spot. Will this guy turn around this way? No, he won't. Okay, good. I'm pretty sure this is a level one door. Yes, it is. The one day door. And this is a uh, there's a sleeping man here, which you can sneak right past to grab the following. Suppressor. I don't understand how anybody would be able to fall asleep while standing up. Oh right, it's already fucking placed. Like as soon as Snake got it, he got placed to fucking turn around, baby. <laughs> Stop! Stop, Snake! Thank you. Jesus Christ! Shit brick. Oh no, that's bad. Okay, never mind. Uh, I should probably start moving. Yep. That's what I'll do. Start moving. Okay. Now this way. I'm pretty sure there were a couple of doors up here that we can already open. Open? We can check from all the way up top. Whoa! Fuck me. Okay, let's see. If we move on now. There we go. This opens, so that's good. And I'm pretty sure over here there was the cardboard box. The infamous. The all known by mankind. It's a level two door, so forget about that. We'll come back to that later. So it's time to get back down again. Back up, back down. Back up, back down. Back up, back down. Black Ops. This is the top secret Black Op. Do not expect any kind of Black Op. <laughs> Alright, easy enough. Easy on the mouth, brutal on the pout. I don't, don't know. On the pout, on the, on the stout. I didn't stout. Miss critical. Fucking the Escapist magazine. Hey, what I love the Escapist magazine. They're so they're so cheeky, so full of banter, full of banter. Right. So we're looking for doors. Which have also be wary of, of traps here. There's a lot of traps. It's no bueno. They will get you killed. But there's also nobody patrolling right now. So level five, forget about that. Pretty sure there was another one that was open. So level three, forget about that. There's a bunch of like floor traps, just like in uh, Metal Gear One and Two. Suck on bullet is all the way up. So fuck that too. Is, is this open? It does open. Great. Grenade, grenade. Granata. And we got as you can see these are the walls that have, have a different color. Because they couldn't they couldn't really change it. And to like spare you the trouble, this is the right one. This is basically the right one. We're gonna place that over there, move on a little bit far away, and kick. You have to actually punch in order to explode it. And there you go. You've done it. We've we've opened the fucking thingy. Voila. Now let's uh, have a little bit of a call. Let's see what's going on here. President Baker should be somewhere around there. Hurry up and find him. Also, you can't use your radar there. Mailing says it's because of electronic jamming. If you want to know more, ask her. Will do. Snake, you can't use your radar in that area. Okay. There's some kind of electronic jamming coming from there. I wanted to know more. What it is. Anyway, be careful. Goodbye. Be careful, Snake. I will be careful. Let's call Natasha about Nastasha, sorry. Harasha. Good. You found a SOCOM. That's a Special Operations Command pistol. Mm -hmm. It's a 45 caliber pistol with plenty of stopping power. Plenty. It's also equipped yes. with a LAM for nighttime L combat. A -M. If you hold down the weapon button, you can train the laser sight on the enemy to help you aim. If you find a SOCOM suppressor, you Which can I just equip did. that too. 
That pistol was designed specifically for use by special forces, so I think it will be useful. Some people find it a little heavy and hard to use, but it shouldn't be a problem for you. Well, I mean, he is snake. He's big fucking... he's big muscly man. Soldiers that have been forged in the fires of battle are used to catching naps whenever and wherever they can. There's a big difference between real soldiers and those kids who have only been trained in VR simulators. That's me. After playing for a long time, you should get some rest too. You know what? You're right. I will. Snake, you can't. I know. I know, Milling. I know. Let's save the data. Have a right, okay? Absolutely. Let's see if she's got anything important to say. Be careful, Snake. Why don't you ever say something deep and meaningful? God damn it. She's supposed to say, like, things about, like, Chinese proverbs and, and refer to stuff. And because I always save a critical points, she can she never goes out of her way to say something important. Great. Fucking awesome. Whatever. I don't care. Be that way, Mei Ling. I will be my way as well.